welcome back to my channel. If you're new, what is up? It's your girl Nicole, aka Lil NTK, and I'm back with another video. You know what I'm saying? In this video, we are working with Wiggins hair, wiggy wig wig, okay? They sent over their Body Wave short wig. Okay, this is a 13 by 4 lace frontal wig. It's 180 density, okay? And I believe I got 16 inches, I believe. All the specs you need to know about this wig will be down below, okay? I believe that I got this in 16 inches and this is a 13 by 4 lace closure. I just had to read it out just to make sure I didn't like forget anything because sometimes like, guys, I need an assistant or someone. If you want to be my assistant, let me know. <laughs> I need someone to help me because I be getting so many of these, e these, these same emails from different people, which is a blessing. I get confused on what is what, what length is what. I'm not a professional either, so sometimes I get it wrong, but if you're ever in doubt, just check the description because all the right information is there, okay? But this hair is from Wiggy Wig Wig Wiggins, okay? Wiggins hair, and I am obsessed with it! I showed you how we installed it, I showed you how we curled it, okay? I showed you how we got from A to B using this wig, and let me tell you, this is my favourite wig ever okay the best beginner friendly wig easy to bleach easy to cut you guys will see it you will see it the only thing i didn't show you in this video was obviously bleaching the knots i am planning on making a separate video on how i do that i just haven't gotten around to doing it yet but that will be done soon hopefully um so you guys will see how i bleach the knots i'm not a professional but i'm just showing you what i do okay you don't have to follow it there's plenty of videos out there already beautiful professional videos i'm just showing you what i do okay but um yeah, I did, that's the only thing I did show you in this video, but everything else from start to finish, how we got here, the parting, everything is what I show you in this video, and I really hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, make sure you subscribe, comment, comment, sis, I'm talking to you, I want to see you liking, I want to see you commenting. Yeah, if I have to tell you guys every video, I'm going to tell you every video, I want to see the link, uh, the engagement needs to go up, okay, period. The engagement needs to go up and you're going to help me do it. Um, so I want to see you liking, commenting, sharing, all that good stuff, and yeah, without further ado, let's just get right into the video. All right, so let's get right into it. So, I've already got my cap on. Um, if you see like white stuff in my hair, don't be alarmed. <laughs> it's just gel. Um, it's nothing but a little bit of gel, okay? Um, so yeah, I've got my cap on right now and we are ready to go. So this hair is from Wiggins Hair. So off camera, I did bleach the knots. Um, this this wig was like the knots was bleached perfectly all my days mm, Blessed bleached knots I've ever done in my entire life, and I'm so proud to say that um, But this hair is from Wiggins Wiggy wig wig, okay, so yeah I did part out the frontal section in the middle because basically I hot combed it and like straightened the wig on my mannequin head but I wasn't sure of what I wanted to do in terms of if I wanted a side part or a middle part I think I'm gonna go for a middle part today I did something with my hair this time last year before I cut bangs and everything like that where um, it was like middle part slick back and I had these outward curls and I want to try and do the same thing with this wig so that is the look that I'm going for so we're gonna do a middle part but first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pop this on my head like so she is a frontal which we love we love a good frontal and this is what she looks like so as you can see she is looking so natural and this is the this is like my favorite length of hair like <laughs> honest to god this is my favorite length of hair like if if i cut my hair if i do anything to my hair this right here is my favorite length of hair to do. It's my favorite. Um, not too long, not too short. It's literally just perfect, in my opinion, for me and my small head. Um, but this is honestly like my favorite length of hair to do. I did adjust the elastic bands off camera, but I think I'm gonna have to adjust them again because this wig is sitting a little bit tight on my head. So we are going to have to do something about that. <laughs> right, so I've loosened it by one. That should fit better. Like I love when my wigs fit snug, but I can always tell when they're too snug when I can't really like budget um, to come forward. And as you can see, that's like naturally just laying a lot better. Whereas before I had to really, you know, pull it to get to where I want it to be. But 
this is sitting so much better this hairline is a little bit forward if you ask me <laughs> so we're all gonna, we are gonna have to do some customizing and hopefully everything works out because i got places to be and i got people to see okay so um we ain't got time for this to not work <laughs> So first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to part it in the middle because I do want a middle part like I said and I've already kind of, I've already got my tools ready so my straight knot is on, my uh, hot comb is on, like everything is ready for me to go so that we can just go and not have to stop for anything which is fab. So I'm just going to take each piece and I'm going to hot comb it first and then I'm going to straighten it after I'm going to do the curls at the end I just want to kind of like get the hair straight so I can see what we're doing and stuff like that so yeah I'm just going to do this all throughout my head so I'm probably going to speed through this part because um, there's nothing really like interesting <laughs> about this part but I'm just going to hot comb the roots and try not to hot comb my face and then I'm going to straighten the rest out like that Alright, lovely stuff. So, I've hot combed her and I straightened it as you guys can see. And even just like this, like I'm tempted to just wear it like this. Like I think even this looks so cute. Oh guys, I can't wait for my hair to grow this length. I'm not even going to flex. This right here is my favourite length of hair. Like I know I'd be requesting to have some long ass hair you guys sometimes but i even go on front like i just i love medium length hair like it's my favorite so what i'm gonna do now is i'm going to cut i did tint the lace by the way as well they sent me a medium brown lace which you guys know um doesn't really work with my skin tone but we finna make it work because that's what we do on this channel but they sent over a medium brown lace so i tinted the lace using my um hair by shop shop almond spray for reference if you guys want to know my my like complexion and stuff in fenty beauty foundation in the winter time i wear 310 i believe and in the summertime i wear 330 but um yeah girl that's what i'll be wearing um but yeah so i'm gonna take my even spray love this spray you guys already know the friggin drill i'm literally like there's like nothing in here yeah there's literally nothing in here no <gasps> no this is like my favorite adhesive ever oh my god i'm so gutted i don't even think you guys understand I, i'm like i'm so upset we're gonna try the olive oil um super hold spray i don't really use this to like glue down my wigs but I really don't feel like using got to be so we finna use this today and I'm gonna put that on two coats dry you guys already know the drill and then we'll keep it rolling and I'll come right back <laughs> okay so we have just applied the lace using the olive oil spray and I'm not even gonna lie I quite like this spray it definitely holds um, I think the true test will be you know how it holds once um, like in a couple of days or so because I don't really know like like I said I don't really use this as like an adhesive for my wigs even though I should because I have it but this might this just might have to be the sign this might have to be the sign that this is the adhesive that I should be using but so far so good like I have no complaints about this my wig feels so tight very tight like girl this this feels like she ain't finna move 
like she feels so tight I love it oh my god guys no I really like this hair you know I'm not even gonna front with you like this Wiggins wig like <laughs> I can already see from like just how it's laying how silky and how flowy it is that I, I really like this hair already like oh my god it's so flowy and that's what I like and that's what I look for in wigs um I, mean, I haven't really been wearing wigs like consistently back to back like how you see me doing here or on my channel um for that long like i haven't been doing this on my channel for time as you guys know but i can i can i can tell the difference between a wig that's like cheaply made and a wig that's that's doing the damn thing do you know what i mean and this wig is definitely doing the damn thing like I, I really like this hair a lot um, like it's just a dream even the lace even though it's like a light brown I took a chance and I tinted it you guys already know how I feel about tinting lace that's already dark it literally just gets darker like there's that's the science behind it like if you try it and make if you put something on top of something that's dark it's gonna get darker you know but with this it hasn't done that if anything it's kind of like tinted it to the right the right color which is like very 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 surprising I'm getting a lot better as well at cutting ear tabs on myself and I'm so happy like out guys I was so nervous to like do this before um, like cut ear tabs off and stuff because I'm not really like that experienced with like doing it and whatever but I'm definitely like a lot better now I think the biggest problem for me and cutting ear tabs is because I can't really see what I'm cutting I know you guys are probably sick and tired of me saying my mirror is so far away but it is like it really is far away um, I need to like update you guys in a vlog or something so you can see my actual setup it's, it's shambolic like it really is shambolic I'm definitely doing a lot better now and that's the main thing you know but yeah so I'm just gonna take some more of that olive oil spray and I'm literally just gonna spray in between just to really knock everything in you know um, no guys this looks so natural like oh my I love it like this this wig is so beginner friendly definitely up there with my top wigs like definitely up there because it's just so beginner friendly like this literally is so beginner friendly that I've done nothing to it and like it's, it's it was easy to bleach the knots like it was so simple sometimes I'm not even gonna lie there's some wigs that I've tried and like if I'm honest some wigs I've tried like it's really 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 hard I mean, guys look at even behind my ears no stop stop no but guys there's some wigs that I've tried um, here on my channel I'm not gonna name what but some of the wigs like are really hard to bleach the knots like the, the way they put the knots in um, in the hair like it's really like it's quite difficult to bleach it um, unless you're processing it for a very very long time which I wouldn't recommend doing um, but some of the knots be so thick it's kind of difficult to like really get in there and really bleach it but with this like the knots were small and perfect like I've, like it was honestly a dream to bleach this like I've had no issues with it at all look at that guys this wig bleached so perfectly <gasps> so I'm just gonna take some more of my mousse and kind of spread it all over it's gonna tame any flyaways and anything like that and then I'm gonna take my hot coat in. And then I'm going to take my Care Care Wax stick and kind of go over everything just to really like solidify that part. 
take my comb and just again really go in now that we've got the wax and just use this to really like solidify and as you can see like it just helps to bring up any extra hairs that were stuck so now I'm just gonna section everything off into smaller pieces so I'm gonna take it I'm gonna curl it out like that Ooh. if you're an OG you remember me doing this style on my hair you remember me doing this style on my hair this time a year ago I can't do that now to my hair because um, it's not all one length anymore it's got like these funky curtain bang wannabe pieces that I'm growing out but you remember this style if you're an OG um, but I'm happy I have this wig because now I can actually do this style without risking my like hair's health and stuff like that because um, I can't lie this hairstyle is beautiful but it's a lot of heat do you know what I mean if you're doing one pass it's fine but if you're not doing one pass like it's quite a bit of heat so I would recommend like if you've got like a wig or something this wig in particular like the length all the specs will be down below so make sure you check it out but um no guys like definitely if you are thinking of doing this style a wig would be better you could definitely do this on your natural hair I've shown that but just to like preserve your hair's health doing it on wigs is, is a bit more ideal in my humble opinion but yeah oh my god no mm -mm 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 -mm. the wig that i was planning on wearing today this is the wig that i'm gonna wear today because oh my lord like are you having a laugh mate this wig right here is beautiful it's bloody beautiful it is like it's, it's fabulous i can't untie it from the back so we're gonna do it like this <clears throat> um all right let me let me let me deal with this i'll be back <laughs> oh my friggin days you guys remember this style on me like i know you remember when i did this style on me <sighs> i love it if anything i'll link it up here so you guys can see when i did this on my hair but no all we gotta do now is cut the um cut the excess lace and then oh yeah this glue is tight oh my so we just got to cut the excess lace which is going to be quite easy and then do some baby hairs and then we're done i'm going to take my razor i'm going to attempt to do this on camera my vision as well isn't the best like my mirror is far but my eyes are bad so i can't really like see too tough but i'm going to attempt to do this on camera because i know like it must be annoying for you guys to like See me disappear and do this off camera because I know you probably want to see me do this. But if I feel myself cutting my forehead. I'm I'm going off camera and <laughs> do this behind the scenes because I can't mm -mm. clip this. All right, so you can see a bit of my hair underneath, but that's fine. I'm going to cover it up with like baby hairs and stuff. Um, I cut a bit too much off, but that is okay. That's okay. I'm going to take my spray. 
Oh my, hold on guys. Right, so now that I'm trying to, I feel like I'm losing this comb a lot today. So I just went ahead and re, um, like cut some of it so it looked a bit better and then I kind of melted it again. Um, and this is where we are, but I'm loving this lace. I'm loving the hairline. I'm loving everything to do with this wig right now. But yeah, I'm gonna just grab some pieces from the wig that I want to make a baby hair, which are these pieces right here. Oh, this wig just looks so natural, I love it. I look, you don't even wanna do baby hairs, but I just feel like it will look really pretty if I, if I do it, so. Yeah, okay. So, I'm gonna start off with, gonna. Why are you still here? Go home. A bit of mousse, and then go. Oh no, this is what I was afraid of. Do like a swoop. Okay, that needs to be a bit shorter. I can see that. Um, oh god, oh god, this is going left very fast. Oh god. with that I think <laughs> oh my lord oh guys this is actually working out okay no this is this is working out this is working out this is working out this is working out for me right let me do this one now This right here, this Wiggins wig, this Wiggy wig wig, Wiggins wig, girl, child, look. Let's get into it. Let me reposition myself. This Wiggins wig right here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I need to cut this bit and kind of, yeah, okay. Guys. Guys. Guys, no, 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 no. And we are back, we are back people. Put a little bit of bling on, cleaned up the sides because you know the glue can kind of get everywhere. And this is what it looks like. This is by far like one of my favorite wigs. I know I've said that a lot recently, but oh my god, this Wiggins wig. Like guys, the wigs that I'm getting is just hitting the way it's supposed to hit. It's giving the way it's supposed to give. Like, I can't even tell you. This wig was so easy to customise. It was easy to bleach the knots. The wig was already pre-plucked. Um, super easy to style. Easy to tint the lace. Um, perfect length on me personally. This is just my favourite length of hair to, to deal with, to work with. But it's like the perfect length. Um, to work with like it still holds the curl like the curls are sitting like I literally just curled it even though it's probably been like 20 25 minutes or so since I did it please don't mind my lashes I'm getting them filled in tomorrow as we speak because this is just not it but I just I have no cons for this wig like no cons at all please make sure you check the description down below you don't want to miss out on this this is the perfect gift to give a family member a friend what whoever you you desire whoever you choose but this is literally like the perfect beginner wig to give anybody any and everybody um it's so nice you don't have to curl it of course you can wear it straight but I chose to curl it to do a little bit you know to do something that's a little bit different besides just wearing your hair straight and also I really wanted to do this style again I miss having my hair like this and I'm excited for my hair to grow out so it can be like this all the time but this is about to be my new favorite wig because instead of me like putting a lot of heat on my natural hair to achieve this look I can literally just wear this whenever I want to wear this look um but no I'm literally obsessed like I have no pro no I have no cons at all with this wig like it's actually it's actually silly. I'm not gonna wear makeup 
for the intro and outro because sometimes we have to appreciate our natural beauty okay <laughs> everyone is beautiful without makeup and I want to emphasize that so you're not going to see makeup the only thing I'm going to do is put on a little bit of lip gloss because my lips are a little bit dry I know you guys are thinking it too I'm just going to put a little bit on and I did uh, just um, I put a bit of brow gel on just so my brows looked a bit better and again my lashes are getting done tomorrow but this video has to go up that's why I'm not doing this tomorrow but anyways I really hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you like subscribe all that good stuff please use my discount code okay it's down below in the description every discount code that I have ever provided with any wig any video is all linked down there so make sure you check it out um, so you can get some money off with whoever you purchase from but make sure you check out Wiggins as well because their hair's bomb it's amazing and um, I need to go out now and I need to do some stuff it's literally like 5.30 in the evening and it's pitch black and I want to leave before it gets darker um, not that that made any sense because it's already pitch black outside but anyways um, my anxiety is kicking in because it's getting dark but I will see you in the next video I really hope you enjoyed this one take care, stay safe and I will see you soon